lovely people. Um, I have been asked to share a few thoughts and feelings with you. So here we go. Um, this is where I spend some of my day at the moment in our home office, um, working for Yeovil for Family, which is what I do as a job. Um, but I'm just going to take you down to where I spend another big part of my day and, and my life, which I love. This is my favourite place in our house. This is our kitchen. This is where I feed my family. This is where my heart sings. This is where I talk to God. This is where angels gather. I love it in this kitchen. Um, I'm just going to share a prayer that somebody wrote. Um, I think it's more of a cry out to God, really. Um, and I'm going to put on my camera around the other way so that you can see my garden while I'm doing it. So lockdown has been very interesting. Um, there's been uh, a lot of intense feelings. Um, a lot of stuff is condensed all the time. Um, there's been some amazing parts to lockdown, amazing parts of um, being together with family and some um, really interesting times of high emotion. Um, and then times when I think I'm so blessed to be um, locked down in such a, a free beautiful country and other times that I felt really guilty about being here when there are people in so many other countries in the world that are so um have so much less than we do so um and I was reading something that somebody wrote and I wanted to share it with you because I thought it was beautiful and it's this father give me the strength of mind to step outside of my reality into yours and then help me to make it mine I need to remember that we are in this world, but we are not of it, and that my origins are now in you. I'm grafted in, adopted in my spirit, deep within your own, and it is from that place of total rest, belief, and ecstatic excitement that I want to live out with you in this earth, the purpose that you have called me to. I'm a visitor here, but I have all the attributes that you gave me I just need to practice them and step away from time into the timeless realm with you, where you teach me the secrets that you have hidden for me to discover for your pleasure, like my Abba hiding gifts for me to find. Thessalonians 5 verse 16 says, Rejoice always and delight in your faith. Another version says, Be cheerful no matter what. So I just want to leave that with you today.